Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and Microsoft has finally settled in to Windows 10 users. Um, if you are on Windows 10 and your machine is compatible with Windows 11, Microsoft is starting to push you towards Windows 11. So basically what happens is that if you go and do a seek, because right now it's for seekers, which means if you don't go and check out your Windows updates, it's not there. But if you go and look, if you're compatible, it'll show up here and say, okay, we've got Windows 11 waiting for you. So that is one of the first steps into pushing Windows 11 on Windows 10. That means that if you don't want to move on, we uh, one of the best things you can do is put yourself in metered connection, which will prevent big updates like Windows 11 from installing. Uh, look at my next video. I'll show you how metered connection works in Windows 10. I've shown you in Windows 11 uh, for the same reason. Um, you're on Windows 10. You might not want to move on to Windows 11, even if, even if your machine is compatible for now. And it's totally understandable. So uh, look at my next video for the metered connection type of uh, blockage, if you want. It's going to be uh, preventing Windows 11. So this is, you know, it's not clear if they're, if they're forcing it or just showing that it's available for you. Uh, one thing for sure is that they'll at some point force it for sure. So uh, even, you know, for them, the uh, extended support and the freedom of you staying on Windows 10 is not an option. They want you to move to Windows 11 as that's the way it works. So um, this is going to be uh, interesting to, um, to see how it goes. But I know that a lot of you will not want to go to Windows 11. So if uh, you don't want to, look at my next video. For those that want to, um, is it a, you know, should I, should I not? If it shows up on your computer with Windows 10, technically it's supposed to be okay to upgrade because the same blockers that apply on Windows 11 24H2 are also um, going to be applied before any update of Windows 10. So if some of the hardware in your system does not is not compatible or shouldn't be upgraded, it probably will not appear. Uh, but do be careful. A big majority of people on 24H2 have absolutely no problem. But for those that do, it is a definite uh, problem. So if you do not want Windows 11 to show up or to install, uh, look at my next video for Windows 10, how to turn on metered connection to make sure that only security updates get installed on your PC. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.